Hi Cancer, welcome to your February 2021 monthly love reading. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Cancer, please bear in mind that this reading will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently or in the future. Okay, Cancer, let's get your reading started. And um, I'm going to do Celtic Cross Bread, okay, for monthly reading. Usually I use a Celtic Cross Celtic Cross Bread. Spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Cancer for this month, February 2021. Please show me more. Cancer, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with. Some advice for Cancer Spirit. I'm going to pull a few oracle cards. Can you show me more? Okay. That's enough. All right. Cancer, okay, in the past, there's the Queen of Pentacles here. I feel like... Um, Again, this could be you or your person, but I feel like a lot of you are actually trying your best to just focus on your finances, focusing on the stability here. But with the Four of Swords, there's a lot to think about. I feel like a lot of strategy or planning, um, I feel like a lot of you are planning um, your future, okay? When it comes to love, especially, I, this is a love reading for you guys, but there's something that's making you very unhappy here with the sun here, okay? I feel um, perhaps something from your past or somebody from your past who could be hiding something or just, uh, I feel like you need clarity and you've been searching for some clarity when it comes to love in general. And you're very unhappy about the situation right now. And the only distraction for you right now is work. That's what I'm sensing. But again, roles can be reversed here. And the judgment is in reverse. I feel like something about your past whom you just don't want. A past experience that you do not want to relive. Okay, but you still think about it. Of course, we're not robots. We can't just, you know, switch on and off. We're, we're not robots. But Seven of Swords here is... Um, sitting in your subconscious maybe this is somebody in your past you could have been dealing with um, maybe somebody was being very sneaky okay they may have been dishonest with you uh, again could be hiding something from you I feel like it traumatized you in a sense that you still can't believe that this happened and you know I feel like a lot of you are left with your thoughts um, a lot of you are thinking, uh, as in needing some time to think about things and think about what makes you happy, what makes you unhappy, and what do you really want when it comes to love in general. But one thing for sure, Cancer, I know that I can see what you don't want is to have the past repeat itself. I feel like that's your, that could be one of your biggest fear. And the tower is in reverse, Cancer. Again, roles can be reversed here. But there is somebody here who um, maybe is trying to fix the damages that they have done to this connection, okay? I do sense it is somebody from your past with the Six of Cups here. But there is a little bit of a hope that perhaps, you know, it's very funny, you know, human beings, you know, our feelings, our thoughts can be really really complicated but i do see a lot of overthinking here but on one hand it's almost like i don't want to return to somebody from the past i don't want the same thing to happen again but then at the same time there's a lot of reminiscing okay with the six of cups here thinking a lot about the past um that could be a fear it's sitting in a hopes and fear position it could be hoping maybe for reconciliation but also at the same time fearing for reconciliation because that could have been that could be a wrong judgment call right may not be a good idea but with the six of swords here in reverse i feel like spirits this is the um advice portion of it 
um, feeling stuck and may not be expressing how you truly feel, okay, or what you truly think about this person or this connection. I feel like Space is trying to advise you to just express it, okay? It says express your love or express your thoughts, express your feelings, go ahead and make this gesture, okay? And healing family issues, for some of you, it has, it's deeper than that, okay? For some of you, with the sun here, sometimes it could indicate children as well, or a child. Um, maybe there are some things I, I was just explaining. You got the same card here as, I think it was Libra, okay? Um, that something, it's just like I was just giving an, an example. It's like uh, growing up, my family, my parents are divorced, so I have problems actually trusting men <laughs> because my dad cheated on my mom. So it's like all of these growing up, watching your mom crying every single night before she goes to sleep, how much she has suffered, and I in turn was also you know, becoming a victim to the entire situation. Of course, it's not easy and being the only child. Um, but, you know, cancer, this is why it shapes us, you know, that this is why there are a lot of, um, with this card especially, whenever I see this card, healing family issues, it could mean childhood trauma, okay? Or maybe currently you're going through some family issues where there, there's some healing that needs to be done here. But I do sense this has something to do with your past, okay? Something from your past that you may have been feeling very traumatized and maybe there is some healing that needs to be done here, okay? And by doing so, I feel like it's to express yourself. A lot of people keep guessing this and that. And you know, um, it's funny because it's like whenever I was you know, uh, requested to do personal reading. I feel like there are a lot of these uh, advice that, that came out in the cards that actually suggest to have an open communication because there's a lot of guessing game going on as in somebody is trying to figure out what this person is actually thinking or feeling and, you know, but actually why not just go straight to the root of, of the cause? Am I saying it right? It's like going straight to the person, to the source, okay? Going straight to the source. I feel like this could be, this could be um, the advice for you as well, Cancer. It is because the sun also indicates something that is, with it crossing it, maybe something that was not clear, okay? So maybe some clarity is needed here. And by expressing, by having an open communication, perhaps you will find your answer if you're looking for an answer here. And that way, whether it's good or bad, at least there's a closure, right? But Spirit is also telling you to love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So um, love yourself first, you know, if you guys know have been watching my videos. I'm an advocate of loving yourself for self. Self-care, self-love is paramount. That is number one. Number one, just like when you're in a, in an airplane, okay, if the oxygen mask fall down, uh, you you have to put it on yourself first. If you don't take care of yourself first, if your child is next to you or person, people next to you who may need your help, you won't be able to help them. So I feel like it's the same case, right? Same thing. And with the heart to heart, see, I, I wasn't, I didn't even look at this card just now. Heart to heart conversations, honestly discuss your feelings with each other. Just being upfront, it's really that simple, but people always make things very complicated. Maybe they have fear or insecurities. Maybe it's you or your person again, roles can be reversed, but this is your reading anyway, Cancer, right? I just feel like I've been doing your reading every single day and I'm already telling you guys what you know. It's good to hear it from somebody else and to confirm it, but at the same time I feel like what is the next move, you know, what's the solution because we need to so solve something here. <laughs> Maybe I'm so used to being a problem solver, I feel like some things need to be solved, you know, it cannot just stay stagnant like that, it's unhealthy. So some things need to change. I feel like um, Cancer, for your reading here, um, and this is why I'm doing this, you know, I feel like you need to get, give yourself some advice, but not everybody likes listening to advice, apparently, <laughs> because a lot of my videos, like they like to hear what does the person feel about you and that kind of stuff, but truly, I feel like we gotta work on ourselves first, number one, okay? 
although it's very juicy to hear this and that, but I feel like, you know, this is why I, I do what I do. It's truly not to tell you what, how this person feels about you. I actually don't even care to say all of these things, but I know a lot of you would like to hear. Maybe you find some comfort in it, but really, honestly, Cancer, I, I would prefer to give some to give advice, you know, that way we can heal faster and we we can find some sort of a solution and we can move forward you know it's all about moving forward because the time is constantly ticking and time waits for nobody all right queen of swords is right here this is actually your future okay i feel like a lot of you you are cutting off whatever that doesn't serve your highest good anymore page of cups in reverse also could be an indication of either a um love offer that is being rejected because they don't see it as genuine or a love offer that is being delayed because somebody is thinking maybe they're taking their time to come in they're thinking and they're planning to sneak their way back in with the seven of swords here and with the queen of swords let's take one more card and see all two cards brother this is beautiful six of wands um, I sense like cancer because of that if you practice self-love self-care it does look like there is somebody here and also if you can just express truly how you feel to whether it's a past person or a new person it looks like there's victory coming your way six of wands if you start um, this could also mean somebody from the past, they may want to return and reconcile here. But for those who are not looking forward to going back to somebody from your past, it does look like there's somebody new coming in for you, okay? And it looks like it's going to be a very successful relationship and very emotionally fulfilling. Um, although this is for the month of February, this could apply to you March, April, whatever okay because again this is a general reading and every each and every one of your divine timing is different even if it's ready for you but you the universe thinks that you are not ready to to receive it it won't happen until you are ready to receive it okay can so this is your reading i hope you resonated i hope it helped you in some way shape or form uh, i am accept, accepting personal reading currently starting from first of february for how long i'm not sure but we'll see but in the meantime take care i hope to see you back here as i've been posting your videos almost every single day lately take care cancer bye